tonight. Here's hoping and praying. Fingers crossed for tonight. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I do again have to thank Nay Rui for that little donation she gave last night. Since we're we're a little over the halfway point now, so I'm hoping in these last yes. two or three days we can make a difference. <laughs> Please. American exercise. I am American boot. <laughs> American boot. All right, allow me to do my thing now. Yeah, we're all right. I'm dead. And I've never really eaten Hot Pockets before J12, so I couldn't really answer that, I'm afraid. Join the party. Hot Pockets. Yeah, wait on you, Ricto. Alright. <laughs> I look like the place that has the bishop. Join us. Someone's a duck! It's a duck! Alright, our eight slots are full. If you couldn't get in there, you can still join the audience, as they have a player slot in this game as well. <laughs> someone, yes, someone is a spark. It's Darkening who is the spark. Alright, well, let's do this thing! I am. I am. Meow. Do not be startled. I am here to guide you as we explore the deepest recesses of your mind. You will build strange and complex worlds using only your imagination and your thumbs. A hypothetical situation missing one key part will be transmitted to your device like this one. Ads before online videos have been banished. In their place Just are 15 second videos of this. They are not skippable. Is life better? There are infinite possibilities you could write in to complete this scenario. Choose wisely then, because everybody else will then answer yes or no. And you will earn more points if you Just split what I the room. Needed. Fitting name, huh? For those of you in the audience, you'll be competing as one player. Your answers will be determined by a majority vote. Yes, even in a nebulous void, democracy is important. At the end of the game, the person who creates the most divisive dimensions will win. Got it? Good. Now let's begin. There are 43 dimensions unknown to man. Although Dimension 22 is a complete ripoff of Dimension 8, it's time to split the room. Dimension 22. Split the room. scenario that has been sent to your device. I think there's something by, Fiji man. Now that I have a moment, uh, let me miss get those notifications. I miss uh, ten bits of Miss Stormwarden. Beep beep. I am a robot. I was built to transform into a foot. Beep beep. Moop maggot. And then thirty bits of Harvest Doom. Join a shadow. Join a shadow. Join a shadow and get the booty. Hmm. And I don't, I'm indifferent about the whole design redesign on Twitch. Fix again, yeah. Oh, he's a sniper. <laughs> this one is called Ruining for Office. A billionaire candidate for governor makes a bold campaign promise. He will pay all your taxes as long as you give up the right to do this. Ooh. Do you vote for wow. it? Wow. Well, you're not really giving us much of a choice there, are we? Hmm. Well, hmm. 
just what I needed. Then bit some Cooper gamer. Beep, beep. I am a motherfucking sheep. <laughs> Yikes! Youch! Oh, that was democracy, that people. It matters. Room to answer. The more bonus points you get. I feel bad for the audience on that one. Here's one I like to call. You must be this tall to vote. Another one? Wow, New all patriotic have been enacted. Thing. Before you are considered eligible to vote, you must do this. Oh, there's this an actual puppy. dog on this year's ballot that is close to being elected. Do you step up and vote? Hmm. A lot of these are uh Defeating the purpose of the game. Again? Wow. Two with no splits. What even? Uh, some of these now, answers are. Binge Pipe presents Shelf Help. Fish. You're somebody who feels lost in life. One day you stumble upon a self-help book at a store. You open it and immediately find answers to your life. When you flip to the cover, you notice it was written by this person. Oh! Who is it? Who? Oh! Again, you're supposed to make the decision as hard as possible. Come on, people. Yeah, three, three times in a row, these decisions have not exactly been made hard. We're not bashing on anybody here, but, uh... <clears throat> It's defeating the purpose of the game. <laughs> and it's fine, Nehrui, don't worry. I mean, it's been a while since oh, I've played this. Oh, wow, we actually have a split. Thank God for that. Oh, God, Storm Warden, why? Damn bag, I gotta change her. <laughs> it's time I just want for to see what he writes. a premeditated murder. Don't worry about it, Nehrui. Wherever you go, you're followed by crows. If you shoot the largest bird, they go away. If you kill any other, they do this. What? Uh, to file in a <laughs> massive shot. orgy. Interesting. Hmm. Is this, I feel like this is, is slowly this degenerating this into... Does this technically need. promote bestiality? I was about to say, I was just like, this kind of is demo it's degenerating into, like, how fucked up we can be. There we go, there's a decent- Look at who rolled this one. Oh, it was me. <laughs> Ten bits of game. I'd rather burn that trouble. Get book. ready for the tax man giveth. <clears throat> a new tax law allows people to claim a deduction if they have this. This Whoa. applies to you, and it would reduce your taxes OC. by 80%. However, this info, by law, would be plastered on billboards throughout your state. Do you take the deduction? Uh... <laughs> Who the hell is that horse-looking thing up there? It looks like it's got a black coat, and it... That's a top hat? <laughs> hey. I don't think I have any... There's <laughs> a guy picking horse up there doing with a top hat. Sad to say, I kind of shifted away from that. Random. These splits. Dark Nin. Play Dark Nin. <coughs> Feast your eyes on fashion fast forward. <laughs> The hot new fashion trend, believe it or not, involves wearing this. What? You have a job interview at a what hip young it? office. Get out! It's the only promising Howdy. job lead you've had in weeks. You have a family. Do you wear it? What are these the fact that... <laughs> Given the fact that mine is really... My OC design is pretty, like, simplistic as of this moment, I wouldn't mind... Yeah. But I do have ideas for him in the future, so... no. Interesting answers regardless, but, uh... I'm beginning to notice a theme with these. Yeah. Oof. That 
Rumble's Mr. Rumble Roses. Rumble Roses. Yeah, that is a very good point they were This waiting. scenario is called Intimate Crescendos. Oh dear. Whenever you climax during sex, uh, you can't control yourself from shouting this. God bless America! Your not a fan. Do you wear a mask to muffle the sound? <laughs> okay, well this one's certainly clever. <laughs> what? The soldier, whenever he finishes. Come on. Oh, God. Only one line's coming up. Okay. Holy crap, it even split. Super split. Mm. It was Skippy. Skippy! Literally, it even split. Good job, dude. And now. Search party. Oh dear. On your family is helping your grandmother search her house, looking for her missing wedding ring. You find <laughs> it, but it is permanently glued to this. Oh! Do you tell grandma you found it? <laughs> Hell. Hello, Slasher Lunar. Good to see ya. <laughs> Funny thing, I was watching some old Shockwave cartoons, and one of them had the this scenario question here. I didn't know what the fuck it was. I didn't know what the fuck it was, and my parents just split their shit. Because they they understood something that I didn't. Hmm. Oh! Uh -huh. yes, what oh, I that's very kind of you. And 10 bits immediately from Goober Gamer. Good lord, no! <laughs> oh, how very kind of you. Is I'll take those points, thank you. Sold seat. Your cross-country flight has been oversold. Surprisingly, a flight attendant offers this <laughs> as compensation to the first person who gives up their seat. You're on your way to your cousin's wedding. Do you give up your seat? Well, I guess this depends on if it's a male or a female flight attendant in this case. That's the thing! If you're gonna, you're gonna get screwed either way. <laughs> so, you, you're kind of leaving it a, whoever wrote this, you're kind of leaving it a little ambiguous, I gotta admit. <laughs> <laughs> the only one whose prompt hasn't shown yet. <laughs> Owie. Well, we'll play more. Yep. <laughs> hey, hey, yeah. I think we already know who's in the lead in this time. Here's where everybody stacks up at the moment. It's Skippy. Well played, sir. Catching up to you. The Skipsters. Oh, crow. Just what I we need. We reached the decisive dimension. Everybody will be presented with a new type of scenario. There will be two options to choose from. Door number one is already provided. You will decide what's behind door number two. Remember, you want to make it as hard of a choice as possible. Oh, and if you correctly predict a certain player's decision, you'll earn some bonus points. Let's begin. Write an option that you think only some people would choose. Remember, we want it, you're trying to make it a difficult choice. The now, toughest choice. And 10 bits of Mr. Board splitting headache, anyone? Slide puzzle. Slide puzzle. Thank you, Adam, for the host. Appreciate it. Hmm. Triggers of people. Uh, 
no, no. Thank you, Goji fanboy, for the host as well. A soothsayer informs you about two wild events in your future. One of them involves getting trapped in a cave, and the other one involves this. She can only tell you about hmm. one. Which event from your future do you want to hear about? Let's see what we got. Trapped in a cave or traps? Traps! Oh my! Great prediction. You just earned some bonus points. Hey! Nice. Oh, okay. like getting trapped in a cave or being swallowed live by a giant. <laughs> oh boy. Interesting. There's gonna be some pictures there. I can tell. Mm-hmm. Oh my! What? I don't think somebody ah. voted. Hmm. Alright, getting trapped in a cave or... Spending a night with Mel Gibson. Mel Gibson! <laughs> hey! I mean, I think I've only seen one movie and that was The Patriot. Mm. That was such a great film. Ah, damn it. Alright. Nice. Ah, bollocks. Oh, well, I'll take Someone. that either way. Alright. Now for something different. Next prompt. You're a stunt double for an action star. You're needed for one of two scenes. You can either stand in for them while he jumps into a speeding car or does this. Which stunt do you perform? All right, let's see. Speeding car or lit on fire? I mean, at least one of these doesn't have the risk of being killed, somewhat. <laughs> yeah. A slow, painful death. What? <laughs> Everyone wants a slow to die. Oh. Yes. Ah. Aim close, sir. Anyways, speeding car, or you could stand in for them in a new scene. Hmm. Hey. Uh, hmm. Broken bones versus uh, dignity. Can we get a well, broken Mario bones versus thing. possibly getting hot yeah. sex? So. Versus <laughs> sex, wild sex, a big sex, loads of sex. Oh, nicely played, Dark Nin. Right. Speeding oh. car or shake your ass. Shake your ass. Watch yourself. <laughs> Show me what shake you're working with. Show me what you're working with. Shake your ass. <laughs> Shaking that <laughs> ass on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> shake your ears. Oh my Watch god. Oh my even. god. Two even skips in one game, Skippy. Holy shit. Wow, there you go. Just what I need. I got the perfect body, but 50 times a day you have to applaud vigorously or do this. How oh, will dear. you achieve your six pack? Oh boy. If one it's of them is a straight Applaud boy. or take a bow. Take a bow. Hmm. <laughs> it's, it's technically a similar kind of thing. So yeah, well, I mean, a Uber gamer. Shake that core. ass for me. Either way, it won't look as silly as CrossFit. Yeah. And it was the audience from this time. Anyways, applaud or punch Rocket in, in the face. <laughs> oh yeah, you crocodile! Smart money. <laughs> okay, Allies yeah, Dragoon with three dollars. Thanks for letting me play yesterday. Hope your grandma can get new hearing aids. Well, I'm sure she will at this rate, hopefully. But thank you very much, Odd Eyes. Storm Warden. What? You get some bonus points. I'm not surprised. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Applaud or do push-ups on only your hands. Wow. What does that mean? Like doing, like literally doing a handstand and doing push-ups? Maybe. If you can do that, I applaud you. You need to have <laughs> some mad-ass bloody strength to do that. Yeah. Door two, if you can do. Door one, if you can do two, you door two. Okay. Alright. 
That's game. Let's see the final scores. It all comes down to this. And the winner is... Me and Rubber Rose is tied. It's Skippy. Yes. Well oh, played, you. sir. Now you're getting licked. And <laughs> Morris takes the award for the most likes. Nice. <laughs> and most dislikes goes to, shockingly enough, Storm Warden. Oh. Bud. So clever, so dapper, what a shocker, you in the crapper. 